my channel. So today I'm doing a Dollar Tree haul. This is strictly Christmas items or things we're making or items I'm gonna be using to make Christmas items with. I don't know. Ew. Oh, well, okay. This has been accumulating for quite some time. I have been stashing it in the corner of my craft room. It is becoming out of hand, so I just want to start jumping in and showing you. Most of this is from the Dollar Tree. Some of it is from Dollar General. And when I took everything out and started putting things together, I realized I probably spent over $100. And I'm dying right now, and I really want to start getting my Christmas stuff out because if you really think about it, I started decorating the day after Thanksgiving, so I'm probably going to stop doing Christmas crafts and Christmas DIYs and things like that probably at the end of November because we want to enjoy our Christmas stuff. So we don't want to keep making it all the way up until Christmas. So I only got about four to five weeks. So I got to get going. So I'm going to show you some items from Dollar General. I picked up four of these. I plan on doing something with this. If not, I might just give them to my mom just to put on her table. But I love these placemats. They say farm fresh Christmas trees, cut your own, and I just really like these a lot. The next thing is I picked up this pillow at Dollar General. It was $8 and it has the truck. I love the truck and I will buy truck everything. So I thought this was really cute and only for eight bucks. I thought that was a pretty good price for a pillow. I also grabbed this doormat. We always have a doormat right in front of our kitchen since that's where we come in at from the garage. And this was only six bucks. And I think this was a really good price for a mat. Presley's in the background playing with like some monkeys. So you're probably gonna hear some, a tiny bit of background noise, but gotta get stuff done somehow. Um, the next thing I picked up is these boxes. I picked up two of these. These were $1.50 from Dollar General. And I don't know if I'm gonna actually do something with these or actually maybe just give them away as gifts, but either way, they're really, really cute. And they have the trucks on every single side. And then the last couple of things I picked up at Dollar General were just these gift bags. This one was a dollar, you get two of them. This one has the truck in it. And then this one just has like the tree on the back side. but I thought those were cute and then two for a buck, not bad. And then I love these burlap bags. Yeah. Um, I think these are so stinking cute and you can just put some stuffing in here, put these under your tree, give them away as gifts, put presents in them. Um, but this one says express delivery. And then this one just has some little flannel on the back, but I thought this was really, really cute. And it looks like a little stamp and has a little Santa. I don't know, I just like that one. These next couple things actually just came from Walmart. I just thought I would throw these in here since they are in my Christmas pile. I picked this up and then I know they have one of these at Dollar Tree. I actually, I actually grabbed that one as well. Um, I like this one a lot better. It is made a lot nicer. But if you're just looking for just something for to last just a little while, this one is made, it's really, it's a lot thicker than this one and it is a lot heavier. Um, but yeah, I mean, for a buck, this one was $4.88, which I know is a little bit more, but I don't know, I just liked this one over this one. It has like the more galvanized stuff, it has like a little pop bottle. Things at the bottom, and then, like I said, the one from Dollar Tree as well. It's just kind of like a nice little comparison of the two. I don't have an issue with this one at all. I think it's really cute. So, kind of glad that they had that this year. And I also just picked up a couple tiny things from Walmart as well. Nothing too big. These little mini ornaments. I think these are super cute. I really like this, like sleigh ride, free cocoa, merry and bright, joy, fresh, farm fresh trees. I think that's adorable. And then I also grabbed some bows. I grabbed some burlap bows and I grabbed some Miss Buffalo Check bows. I grabbed these because I am not super good at making bows. So I thought that this was just, this was gonna work out way better for me. These were a dollar, what were these? I think they're a dollar 88 for these and maybe a dollar 88 for these. I can't remember, they don't even have the price on them like they normally do. That's what I got at Walmart. All right, Dollar Tree, there's a lot. So bear with me, I'm trying to move as fast as possible. So I found these, I think these are new at Dollar Tree. They had these, um, they're candle holders. So they're like mini wreaths that you stick candles in, but I think these will be cute for signs. So that is probably what I'm gonna do with these. I picked up three of these or two of these. Okay, two of these. So I got these two. I love the white berries. I also picked one up with red berries and like some flock pine. I don't know, I always like, I can't ever, 
say that, that right. I also picked up two of these. They had tons of these in my dollar store, but I didn't know what I wanted to do with them, so I just grabbed a couple. And then I grabbed two of these. These are little clips, and they have the cotton and a pine cone and some red berries on them. I thought these were super cute. I grabbed these two. These are for a Christmas DIY project. These are always there. They are wood, and they are already pre-cut for what I want so I thought that was perfect as well also picked up some signs and I'm regretting even buying these I thought I could stick them together to make them longer I picked up these these I picked up four of these the same ones and then I'm probably just gonna have to do something on the back side because I wanted to stick them together until I realized it is going to leave some nice gaps in between so I don't know what I was thinking that I thought I had like an amazing plan and that just like really backfired but I'll figure something out picked up these two these are really cute I probably will do something with these if not they're so cute the way they are like these are adorable so there's like a Santa says joy there's a snowman says Noel adorable signs they had buffalo check like crazy this one says tis the season it's the red and black buffalo check they had this little plate right here it says cookies for Santa. This one is also really cute. I am just gonna keep these and use them for Christmas because isn't that what we use plates for? Like we don't always have to create something. We can always just use it as is. Picked up four of these Buffalo Check placemats. These are really nicely made and I actually seen some at Walmart today and I think they were like four bucks a placemat. These ones were only $1. So picked up four of those. I grabbed a candle, a red one. They didn't even have white, so I stuck with red. I grabbed two of these. I don't know really why I'm showing you guys these. I picked up some candlesticks. I have candle holders that I just want to put candlesticks in. So nothing like, oh, what are you going to do with those? I'm just putting them in candle holders. That's it. Oh, I did grab an extra one of these. That was in my pile. I grabbed these branches. These are so so cute i think they're a tiny bit messy but i love the way they look they look like they have snow on them they're kind of sparkly but not super sparkly i don't know why my hand's shaking i'm like trying to hold it together i'm just really excited i guess but yeah so they're super sparkly and i really liked those so i picked up quite a few of those eight or nine i think i kind of just grabbed like a handful or like whatever was there i just grabbed them I picked up this table guard. Everyone says, pick something like this up at the dollar store. You paint on your floor. Yep, I do. And uh, yeah, I grabbed something. So that is going to come in handy. These cute bows. I like these. They're kind of like burlap and they're kind of sparkly, but they're not like the messy sparkly. So grab those. I grabbed this candy cane. It's not even a wreath. It's a candy cane decoration or a, um, I don't know, something to put on your wall or your door. They also had this one as well the little truck says merry christmas i think this is cute i think this may be able to come off nicely if not um that's okay but i have an idea for this this is really cute i grabbed what else is in here they had the miniature trees i already used um the green ones but i bought two packs of these white ones and they have like those like cute little miniature houses and stuff i'm not really into that stuff so i didn't buy any of these but i did buy two of these two for two bucks good deal these were super cute i grabbed two of these i want to do some sort of giveaway so you guys stay tuned for that let everybody know i want to do a giveaway i'm really close to hitting 50,000 subscribers not like super close but like i'm on my way there so i want to do like a 50,000 subscriber giveaway if not i still want to do a giveaway sooner for christmas yeah so i picked up one of these for me one of these for somebody special that watches myself and subscribed because Christmas is coming it's the time to give and I want to give back to you guys just a little bit I'm not rich <laughs> obviously you guys watch me buy stuff at Goodwill in the dollar store um but no they had some really cute stuff and I know some people cannot find the red truck things so I'm gonna throw quite a few of like the Dollar Tree red truck items in here this is just gonna be one of them also I grabbed these um, these are like these incense holders. Um, they're like falling right out of the packaging. They're like, I seen Kristen from Electric Kristen. She made something super cute out of this last year. So I kind of want to recreate something that she made possibly with these. So I picked up these and, um, I will link that video if I do that, or maybe I'll just link it in here if I can remember, but she made a really cute Christmas ornament with these. I don't even know if she did a video on them. 
Um, it's on our Instagram. I also found this cup, Red Trucks, super cute. I picked up one of those. I love using these cups. These are like the only kind of types of cups I use. I grabbed just some boring old garland. This little fingertip towel. This is also going to be part of the giveaway. I think it's probably going to be more next month just so I can pick some random things up and then I will do like a whole giveaway video, but just some little sneak peekers. Um, I grabbed, this is new if you guys don't have that craft aisle. Let me know how many people have the craft aisle at the Dollar Tree. I want to know how many people have it because I'm thinking about picking fun items up like this for the giveaway because so many people obviously DIY and do things like that and then they don't have one of those and then they can't buy items like that. So I really want to like find some fun stuff there. There's like, there's so many incredible items at mine. Um, but they had a chalkboard paint just in this tiny little thing. I thought this was perfect because you rarely go through this or at least I don't and some people just use like black paint but this is I think the key. Um, I grabbed two of these arrows they look like this i think they look more like houses and that is why i bought those i grabbed these wood slices right here these are in like the fun craft section i grabbed those i grabbed tiny tiny little canvases i have a ton of canvases to use but i just grabbed the tiny ones I grabbed some of these chalkboard tags. Um, Presley threw this in the cart. This is another one of those coffee mugs, but it has um, coffee mugs on it. Okay, makes sense. Uh, one of these cones, because it looks like a Christmas tree. I also grabbed this fabric from Walmart. This is really random, I just found it, but um, I don't even know what I'm gonna do with this or if I'm gonna use it, but that was compulsive buy. I picked up these fun little truck bags. I think these are super cute. And then the last couple things are not even Christmas, but I thought I would show because I think they are great stocking stuffers. So I grabbed two of these Hatchimal surprise toys. Yeah, they have Hatchimals at my store right now. So super cool, Presley will love these. I grabbed a couple more of these mad toys. Um, the kids opened them and they're like keychains or like necklaces or something like that. And they really like them. And I, people are like, yeah, this is a thing. And I got online and watched some of these on YouTube. Oh goodness. It's just one of those little kid things. I don't know. It, I couldn't watch it. It was like a really terrible YouTube video, but the kids thought these were fun. So grab those. And I also seen these. These are all over Dollar Trees. So if you guys have little boys or little girls, I have little girls obviously, but my little girl loves um, boy stuff. And you know what? And I don't care. And if that's what she likes, that's what she likes. And boy toys are more fun than girl toys anyways. I'll play with a train or a truck or a car or a superhero more than I really want to play with a baby doll. These are stocking stuffers for Scarlett. They have the NFL and these are Legos. She's obsessed with Legos and like loves them. So I thought these were super cool. So I picked up three of these NFL ones. Presley is drinking out of her coffee cup with nothing in it. So if you hear, right? <laughs> and then I also picked up three of these NBA stars right here. So super good stocking stuffers. Save them. I have a really bad thing of like giving my kids their like, oh, I got you a prize toy because they're so expensive at the stores. They're like between like three and 10 bucks, just depending on like which one you get. It is insane how much those are. But Presley loves prize toys and that's all she asked for for Christmas this year. She doesn't really get the whole concept of it yet, but like once she does, I think she'll be like, holy crap, this is awesome. But she just wants prize toys. But you guys, that's it for the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave it a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below. Do you guys have that? fun awesome craft section in your store the more no's i get probably the more stuff i'll buy so let me know for the giveaway obviously like i've been buying for the giveaway so yeah anyways let me know in the comments below if do you have it yes or no and let me know what state you're in you know what i never ask that some people just write that but i'd love to know who watches my videos and where you're from please let me know where you're from i never ask that i cannot believe i don't ask that i brag i don't know if i brag do i brag about being from michigan all the time i'm from michigan yeah i'm from michigan i like to know where you guys are from let me know that let me know about your craft section and if you are new to my channel i would love you to hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on any more videos and i'll see you guys in the next video bye